Namaste, good morning everyone. My name is Cassandra and I'm gonna take you through this short morning yoga practice. Please begin by sitting up nice and tall. You won't be needing any props today and this is suitable for all experience levels. So as you lengthen your spine, feel your shoulders draw down and away from your ears, chin parallel to the floor, and just go ahead and close your eyes. Take these first few cleansing breaths in and out through your nose. Maybe asking yourself, what is your intention for the day ahead? Maybe simply choosing one word. And keep your eyes closed. Just drop your right ear towards your right shoulder. You can lean your chin up a little bit. Maybe use your right hand to pull your ear further away from that left shoulder. And you can also lengthen and reach your left arm out to the side. Just a big stretch in here. You still wanna have that same smooth, steady breath flow. And bring your right hand to your ear and the side of your head. Go ahead and lift up and we'll switch sides. Left ear to your left shoulder. Maybe use your left hand to pull your ear away and you can crawl the right fingertips out to the side. Not chasing sensation here, whatever is good for you. Use your left hand to help lift your head back through to center, shrug your shoulders down. And now go ahead and just bring your feet out in front of you, maybe a little wider than hip width with your toes pointed forward. And you can drop both knees over to the right, flexing through your feet, and then back through to center, and then over to the left. So just a very simple windshield wiper motion to begin with. Notice if you feel this in one hip more than the other, Take one more here. And now the next time your knees drop over to the right, see if you can turn over towards your right thigh and right knee and bow forward and down. Push into your hands, lift your chest up, and then bow forward and down, maybe getting a little bit lower this time. Last one, inhale, lift, and exhale, bow all the way down. Push into your hands, lift up, and we'll go do the same thing on the other side. So squeeze into your glutes to lift the knees through center, drop them over to the left, and then start to hinge at your hips as you bow onto your left thigh. Inhale, rise, and exhale, maybe getting a little further into it. Last one, inhale, and exhale, bowing down. Push into your hands, come all the way back up. Lift your knees and this time go ahead and bring the soles of your feet together to touch. Knees fall apart. You might wanna hold onto your big toes with your two piece fingers. Cat and cow, as you inhale, squeeze your shoulder blades behind you. Lift up through your chest. Exhale, round and contract. Chin down, drop your head. Inhale, lift on up. And exhale, round and contract. Last one, inhale and exhale. With your neutral flat back, we're gonna walk the hands forward and fold. Baddha Konasana in your seated butterfly. Engage through your glutes and through your quads to press those knees open a little bit wider. Stretch out of your lower back. And let's walk our hands in so we can lift head and shoulders. 
coming into tabletop pose onto hands and knees. Spread your fingertips wide, palms underneath your shoulders, knees underneath your hips. Firm up through your belly, really strengthen and engage through your core in this pose. We're gonna kick that right heel up to the sky and then open the knee to the side and back down, tracing some circles. I want you to be really mindful that you're not leaning all of your weight on your left arm and that you're also not bending your left elbow. So keep pushing into that right hand take one more here inhale and then we'll step that foot to the top of the mat into our low lunge the knee is over the ankle on janiyasana lift up maybe plant your palms together shifting the gaze to look past your thumbs release your hands down to the mat easy twist tuck the back toes under lift your back knee off the floor and reach your right arm up to the sky stacking one shoulder over the other Big breath in here. Vinyasa, right hand down, step the right foot back, lower to your belly. Point your toes back, Bhujangasana, Cobra Pose. Exhale to release, Adho Mukha Svanasana, our first downward facing dog. So don't worry if there's tightness in your legs or through the spine. Just find your version of the pose that feels the most comfortable to you right now. Try to relax your head and your neck. And draw your lower belly in. And let's find tabletop pose once more. Bring your knees down to the floor. So really engage and squeeze through your abdominals so we're not swaying in our low back here. Try to isolate your left hip as you kick that heel up. Open the hip out to the side and down. This time you want to emphasize pressing your right elbow straight and leaning on your left palm a little bit more. The next time you rotate, you'll step it through on Janiyasana, low lunge, your knees over your ankle, push into the ground, root to rise, press your hands together. Into your easy twist, right hand is under your shoulder, lift the back knee off the mat, reach your left arm up and really push down into your big left toe as well. Release, plank pose, lower all the way down, Bhujangasana, back bend. Downward facing dog, lift your hips up and back. Push back into your heels. And let's just find a ragdoll fold. So you can start walking your feet towards the middle of the mat and walk your hands back to meet your feet. You might want to widen them a little bit, bending your knees so you can drape and rest your belly to your thighs. You might want to hold on to the elbows, swaying a little side to side. Let's take a cleansing breath here, in through the nose and out through the mouth. <sighs> Letting it go. What is your one word intention this morning? Fingertips to the floor, turn your heels in, toes out, malasana, into your squat. Use your elbows to press your knees open a little bit wider as you ground your hips and stretch up tall. Press your palms together. And release, come to take a seat any way that is comfortable to you here, whether you're cross-legged or kneeling. Join your hands, the center of your chest. Affirm this one word intention for your day. And let's close with the chant of Om one time together. Inhale to chant, big breath in. Om.
Namaste. Thank you so very much for doing this short morning yoga practice with me. I hope you feel energized for the day ahead. If you'd like to stay on your mat a little while longer, you could do this meditation that you see on the screen here. Please subscribe and let me know what your intention is today. Leave me a comment and hopefully I'll see you again tomorrow morning for more morning yoga.